One family photo in front of giant cocks. Breathtaking. Whenever people start talking about Kansas City, I like to think that it's really good if you land there for like a layover. Just don't stay there for 17 years and buy a house. Like most unreasonable people, the first thing we did after landing for our vacation was immediately drive to a brewery, Boulevard Brewery. Their bar is called Beer Hall, where they serve beer, food, good views, and love. They are famous for their Boulevard unfiltered wheat beer, and it was at the top of our things to do in KC list. Now we're gonna go walk around Union Station for a little bit. Did you see that T-Rex? I wonder if it's real. Union Station is a full frontal, real train station that is fully restored in the 90s. They have exhibits, concert, and an old-timey original restaurant called Harry's. Oh yeah, and a train station, I guess. Cafe. Cafe. That's how you say it in Vietnamese, too. Cafe. Look at that adorable little coffee, food, beverage, truck, trailer situation. They make Vietnamese-infused drinks, and it's worth the drip to come visit them in their parking corner of downtown KC. Now that we're all jacked up on coffee and Mountain Dew, it's time to go visit a museum. This is the Nelson Atkins Museum of Art. And mini golf. Oh yeah, oh, yeah indeed, sir. And, um, cornpole, I guess? But they also have art, if that's your thing. One of the four water lilies paintings by Monet is usually here. Today it's shown with lighting that mimics the sunrise and sunset with sounds of nature, like this bird. Wow, that's a nice bird. Or just walk around the outside, like two trailer park girls. If it's a nice day, bring a blanket and eat lunch under one of the huge cocks. Did you like the Nelson Atkins, but they kicked you out for disorderly conduct? <laughs> Classic you. Well, they'll probably arrest you if you do that here too, but here's the Plaza Art Fair. Look at that, that's a freaking oil painting. And look at that photography. That, that looks real. Well, it is, or was. And then look at this lady sitting on a mini guitar tar with an apple and some bird things. Just look at it. Oh, and this is the story of how I almost spent $1,500 on a Hot Wheel Loop inspired marble holder. Pretty short story, actually. That, that's it. Want to visit the best gas station in the world? Well, look no further than Quick Trips, because they're the best. Take that Wawa 7-Eleven or whatever you guys are. Hungry again? <laughs> you animal, you. Just go to another gas station, actually. Joe's KC, uh, used to be known as Oklahoma Joe's, has their original location in gas station. Uh, just look at that guy pumping gas in his G-Wagon while some other dude 10 foot away works his way into a triple bypass heart situation. And it's a great state of Missouri, so you can buy oil, Windex, beer, all on the gas station side. Get the Z-Man sandwich and fries. If you want to kick your life into expert mode, get it on buttered Texas toast instead of buns. And I swear that the downtown part of KC just looks like model railroad set. Like, look at that, a little adorable train in the background. Got some love over here. Yeah. Want even more barbecue, you filthy animals? Well, go visit Fiorella's Jack Stack Barbecue. There's a few locations around the metro area. And get the baby back ribs. Tell him Matt Dead sent you. Things move a little bit slower and simpler in central and western Kansas. Whenever you find yourself accidentally wandering around western Kansas, I've got the brewery for, well, a couple of you, I guess, probably. Walnut River is not only good, it's kind of your only option on this side of the state, probably. So enjoy it. I mean, if Abraham Lincoln signs off on it, it's good enough for me. So this is the old Oxford Mill. It's been here since like the late 1800s. I think it milled flour. All I know is is that we had my junior prom here and it did not look like this. It used it was, to be pretty. It was beautiful at my plant and soil science class. Ripped out all the weeds, planted beautiful shrubberies and flowers. The shrubbery has seen better days is what she's trying to say. It's mainly weeds. Bring me a shrubbery. Yeah, mainly weeds. Oh, is it recording? Yeah. Oh. All you gotta do is... Well, shit. <laughs>
She's such a diva. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. Ugh.